this game against Mission Viejo, just this big powerhouse, and you come out here and battle with them, you get a victory, it's huge. Hey Cody, you came into the season, you know, as a unknown guy, yeah. replacing the, you know, County Player of the Year and Cody Fajardo. I mean, look how far you've come. I mean, what a journey you've had. I mean, were those shoes, how big did they feel to, uh, feel to feel? Well, they were, I mean, all the hype about Cody Fajardo. He was a phenomenal player, but I just tried to do my job. I didn't need to make the big plays. I had other guys like Malik Phelps and Robert Beta. I had guys around me that made me better, so it was but you showed tonight that you can make some big plays. Yeah, I mean, you can't underestimate me and I did stuff, but I mean, it's all thanks because of the big plays by my other players. Right. Did you feel like you guys, you, like you had to make big plays tonight? Um, no, I'm, I felt like we needed some big plays to stay in this game because I, we knew that they were going to score on us. It's a mm -hmm. powerhouse offense. We're going to have to play as a team in the offense, but I mean, if we just do what we do, then I don't have to do anything special. Hey, Cody, was there a point during this year or that you felt like you could be the quarterback of this team? I mean, did you know right away? Did you did it take a couple games? Well, um, I really settled in after Oceanside. I mean, I mean, first varsity game against a state defending state championship. But after that, I mean, my team backed me up and counted on me, and I just did what I did. When you guys watched film this week of these guys, I mean, last year they were pretty impressive, yeah. and, and, and it was a little bit intimidating uh, until, until Coach Thomas sort of had convinced you guys that you guys were just as good. This week in film, was there any of that intimidation at all? No, I mean, they're, they're a big team. They hit hard, but, I mean, we just looked at it like another game against a good team. I mean, we've been playing good teams like Marde, Alamany, San Margarita. It was just another game for us. I mean, that's what we thought. Really, just another game for you guys? Well, I mean, the CIF championship is big, but our coaches try to keep it like it was just another game, not try to get too hyped up about it. Does it, How mean, special more, it, does it mean more to beat these guys, given what happened last year and well, all that sort of I stuff. I mean, it was just a, I mean, it's a huge game against a big team and that's what everyone wanted to see, number one Mission Viejo versus number two Servite. And I mean, it was the hype of the year. So to come out here and beat them is phenomenal for our program. How special is it to repeat in this division and go 14-0 at the same time? I mean, it's crazy. I don't know how, what else you can ask for. And to, to win the Pac-5 championship two years in a row, I mean, it's something special. Hey, Cody, what do you think you improved in the most this year? I mean. You were able to be a dual threat guy, but I mean, where, where did you grow the most this most this season? I think I grew in my leadership ability because at the beginning of the year, I mean, I had to step into this role to be the leader of this offense. And I mean, we had a pretty young offense and I think we did that pretty good. And that was, I think, my best improvement of the year. All right, congratulations, Cody Pittman. Thank you.